Well, fuck it. Let's look at three more free games today. I enjoyed it last week and I found three more interesting and slightly strange things. To start with, we've got Space Train Simulator. And then there's one about an acrobat dog. And then I fall off a bicycle. It's going to be good fun. Okay, I am in. This is Space Train Simulator. Currently, we have no cargo. Uh, this is my view. We've got a uh, time remaining, which is ticking down. Space box. Got a little view here of what's in front of us. A little view here of what's behind us. And cool sci-fi cowboy music. Anyway, let's make our train go and you'll see that we get a little bit of cargo attached to us. Right, we've got two trains. Uh, two pieces cargo. One going to Freeport 7 and one going to Arc Nanotechnologies. We'll tap tab. Freeport 7 is 8,000 away. How close is... Uh, now take one, geez. 3,000 away. We'll, we'll drop the cargo off there first. And we have to follow this vaguely. Now you can have a little look at the back here and then you can move down and see all your different bits of cargo. That's something you want to see. Uh, you, you lose money if the thing that you deliver is late. So you've got to be a bit careful of that. Uh, also, this is a little bit confusing to work out where it's going and you can't see more than like a few feet through this smog. So it actually becomes quite difficult to see where it is you're supposed to be going. You tend to crash into it. Or, in my case, completely missed the bloody thing. Right, I assume... I assume I, assume, I assume I should go to the third person view to try and see where it is. Yes, that's just swamp. I'm just in space swamp. Right, slow the old space train down. There it is, there it is, I can see a thing. Good, oh great, we've come in at 90 degrees. Always coming out at 90 degrees, that's apparently a rule. I've got to go through these little green things. We'll be giving new ones and cash these ones in. Doing a bit of a quick turn here. Should we slow that down? Lovely. Lovely. Bollocks. 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 Lovely. Roll. It's full 3D uh, travel. So you're going to be pitching and yawing and rolling. And I've crashed my train into myself. Reverse. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, God. Oh, uh, yeah. So this happens a lot in this game is you'll crash. You'll crash a lot. Right. Get some speed up. Go, just go through it. Just go through it. Just go through it. It'll be fine. And we've dropped you off. Right. The free pot seven is that away. We've made 370. Nice. Normally you, you run out. Of, I find I'm at negative money whenever I finish playing this game. So positive money. I'll take it. And that's our destination. I can't work out what the entrance is. That a little bit the entrance, or is that a little bit the entrance? I'm right up to my screen. I think it's that little bit. I think there's a few extra pixels. Ah! If only I had a 4K screen. All right, it was this way. This is a good angle. This is a good time. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Really slow down. This one's got spiky bloody walls. Right, don't have to go through it the right way around. Don't even have to stop. Just got to go through it. And we've dropped them all off. We've got to go to uh, Sikorovsky. Yeah, that one. We're going to that one. It's miles and miles and miles away. Oh, it's miles and miles and miles away. We've only got 20 seconds to do it. The time limits seem to be completely random and screwy. So, prepare to lose all of your money due to the time limits. But as long as you're having fun, you know, being a space train driver. And that's all you need. Woo-woo! Just having a bit of a snake. And it clears out the old fog. The old space train fog. Whoa! Steady on. Why like you can sit at the back and then drive it from the front. It's kind of like the DLR. Ah, I found it. There it is. I'm guessing that the entrance and exits are on these sides, so we're going to have to pop around the sides. Keep it straight. Keep it in that window, and then we'll come around nice and fast and sharp. Straight through there. We're a little late on some of these, and that one's about to finish off. Ah, well, but we should be able to bank ourselves around there nice and neatly. No, we need to go a lot steeper. Oh, this is going to be unpleasant. All right, I'm turning at it, but I appear to have actually lost where it is when it gets up a little bit as well. It should be. It should be. There it is! It's gone. I've shut the bloody thing. All right, slow, slow, slow. We're just going the other door. Just going to keep it there. So I see a little red dot there. All right, keep that little red dot in my sight. Okay, we're going to go in that. We're going to go in that door there. It's going to be a very sharp turn. <laughs> this is not the sort of angle of attack I wanted. I'm perfectly honest. I was trying to come in nice and wide. All right, start pulling in now. Yes. This is. This is why there's very few uh, space train drivers. And the ones that are still around, they're always on strike. It's a very difficult job. Should be able to, they should have more green dots. Make it more obvious. Oh, pushed the wrong button and sped up there. Let's say I pushed the wrong button. I did, I pushed it. And we are in. All right, full speed through here. Trains will leave, trains will turn up. And we got to, oh, and I, ah! Oh, I think I've been flung off into space. Right, considering this is my current view, I think, yes, I think I'm 
slightly get into a place. I think I'm pulling up. I don't quite know. Yeah, there we go. No, I pulled it. I pulled out of it. There we go. Right. So we just got to go up and around and tuck ourselves through the gas guard. No, that's pointing. Is that pointing over there? Or is that just where I came from? No, I think that's generally pointing there. We actually see. When, so when does that line up? Does that line up when it's over there? That radar is that radar is perfectly aligned with itself. Marvelous. All right, we're coming in hot in this one. Oh shit! Oh, that's so far too fast. Go, go, go! Careful, 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 careful! Oh my god, I nailed it. Oh yeah, minus three hundred dollars. We are doing well this time. Seriously, that's that's doing well. To three point seven miles away. What about Ark? Technologies. I'm having a lot of luck with ARCs recently. ARC Technologies is only 1,500 away now and I can't see it. It's only 1,000 away now and I can't see it. It's only 800 away now and I can't start. Oh, I can see it! I can see it! It's right in front of me! Alright, sharp turn, sharp turn, sharp turn. Oh, this is a terrible idea. Twist into it. Twist, pull, 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 pull. Slow, 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 slow. <gasps> I fucked up! Oh, we threw it through Spood! Spood! It's like speed and food at the same time! Just, I think it just means there's snacks there. Only minus 206. Free pot 7 is now closer. So we're gonna go there. I'm gonna do a damn side bad job of landing in it and then we did that one. Oh, no, I'm not at that one! Oh, I'm wedged between the side! <laughs> How did I fit through there? Oh, my space train's gone off. Yeah, that's not... That's not great. I like... Alright, well... As my space train gets flung into the sun, we'll, um, we'll go do something else, shall we? Yeah. Next up, we have Acro Dog, starring Lil Houndini. Houndini. Uh, it's a very simple game. It says hold Z and M to start. Uh, Z pulls that side down, M pulls that side down, and you got to keep the dog in the spotlight to please the audience. Oh, steady on. And he'll walk where it goes, and he'll be flinged off and that sort of thing. Ah! And people throw beetles at him because they're bastards. Oh! Right, I threw a dog into the crowd there, which everyone loves, free puppies, but also kind of lost him from a circus. Let's try again. All right, whoop, get him in the middle, good jump. There you go. If you're not in the middle for, uh, if you're not in that spotlight for too long, then he's going to have tomatoes lobbed in. As far as I can tell, I think that's the mechanic of why tomatoes are thrown at you. Oh, I think, see, that thing weighs the thing down, so I've got to be careful. This is, this is one of those games you're like, oh, that's interesting, and then you play it, and it's seven years later, and you, everything's left you, but you're still having fun, so that's fine. Oh, no! Oh, just caught him there! Oh, he's been crushed by a visual! Mind the tomato! If a tomato hits you, you lose! You gotta be careful! Well, <laughs> and again, throwing him back into the audience. Alright, drops into the middle. I'm ready for it. It's just sentient, it's just sentient. There we go, keep going, keep going. There we go, nice and centered. Nice and you're like a zen. Like a zen Buddhist, you're centered. Oh, fuck. Okay, we're just gonna weigh that down. No, that's fine, that's fine. You go back, you go back, you go back. Oh, actually, no, you be this side. Actually... <gasps> Oh, I think they shot that one. <laughs> Maybe that's just the sound of a clown being shot of a cannon in the background. It's a circus, you never know. Alright, we're doing good here. That's a nice that's a nice little place to sit. It's gonna go that way. Beach ball's doing its thing, but I can get rid of the beach ball nice and easily. It's gonna be a record. Feeling the record. Let's just keep him up in the air. You wanna you gotta you gotta try and fling him, but without actually getting any distance. You gotta try and listen to yourself. L listen to yourself. Okay, there we go. Not cat him, catch him. We'll never say cat into a dog, it's very offensive. No! <gasps> My dog was killed by a beach ball! It's like the time I played Cooler World for 24 hours and neglected everything in my life again. Alright, over there. Keeping him up high, keeping him up high. Look at that, little dainty taps. Look at that, see those dainty taps? I'm gonna push him back. Oh, the old, the old beach ball's having a pop. We're alright, we're alright, we're alright. Okay, we need to just bring him back that way. Yeah, let's... Okay, well... Gently... Oh! Tomato in the air. He's still alive though. Yeah, let's just I just put him backstage again so we can have a bit of a wash. He needs it. Okay, approaching ten seconds, so the beach ball's on its way. I was ready for it. Did a trick off the beach ball. Then who's a good boy? I'm a good boy. Oh, this is perfect. Just sit there. Give me the best time. Thanks, game. Run, 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 run. No beach. Oh, oh, the tomatoes helped me dodge the beach ball. Get him up there. Nice. Keep him up there. Keep keep him up there. Keep him up there. Nice. And now we'll just settle him down here. Don't lick the tomato off, you'll get fat. Up we go! 30 seconds! Went off the top there. <laughs> Don't worry, an acrobat's gonna catch him if he goes up there. That's what they're paid to do. Probably. Oh no! It was distracted by the tomatoes and he fell off the end. We've all been there. One last go. 30 whatever seconds to beat. I feel like I can do it as long as I get some nice uh, spotlight spawns. That's nice. Probably gonna zoom off to the left so I'm ready. Oh no, wait on the right. Whoop. There we go, that's fine. Oh, the beach ball and me are going to have a, 
a duet now, apparently. Just gonna hop over there. Oh, the Beach Balls decided to leave. Goodbye, Beach Ball. <laughs> oh, very nice, very nice bit of a spotlight in here. Come on there. Oh, a little bit. Uh, uh, hey, there we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, Beach Ball. Ping. Uh oh. Ping. Oh, it's very hard to get over the Beach Ball considering you're firing it the same way. Oh, and it was tomorrow. Who brings tomatoes to a dog circus? Who? Finally today we have Bic Rash. I believe how you spell it. This is a cycling game where you have a little bit of a cycle. You've got a few extra controls. You can jump and you can kick left, right or both at the same time. You can tell by the debris that uh, other people are going to be around this place. And this is just a... <laughs> this is just a stupid little game. Oh, no. I've had a crash into Charlie Brown. And I'm just going to lie here. Oh, no. I was just... I'm inspecting this. He's actually he's a barrier inspector. He's doing a good job. <laughs> so, <laughs> you could do that as a TV show. He's the barrier inspector. But can he inspect the barriers in his own home? Just shots of his wife. You never loved me properly. And he's just there, like, collecting barriers. <laughs> he's just got barriers over in his house. Just on the walls. And she's just, like, going to leave him because he's too into barriers and he doesn't realise it. They've got a communication barrier. It's the joke. <laughs> Fuck it. It's 3am. Hang on a second. It's 4 or 6 a.m. I should be in bed. I also just realized that the grass just appears to be assorted cucumbers. All right, let's do this again. The, uh, the thing. Oh, God, big hop. The, uh, the map appears to be different every time you play. Kick him and jump. Very nice. And kick him. Ooh, water table. Yeah, cups everywhere. The red cups as well. That was like a really elaborate game of beer pong that I just fucked up there. Kick that way, kick that way, and kick both ways at the same time. He actually, that is very impressive because he's still pedaling somehow. It's very impressive. Right, we kick Charlie Brown. Sucks to be you, Charlie. Kick that guy. <gasps> Have a jump. Oh, I kicked that guy in mid air. <laughs> he's in space now. All right, serious bit of turning. No, no, I made it. Oh, I've just realized that when you jump, you can still turn to the same, the same degree of accuracy. <laughs> Oh, I jumped a bit too early. Oh, I panicked. And I've crashed. And I just lie here and accept defeat. We're kind of like a bloody Auton. I have no facial features whatsoever. I kind of want to draw like red. It's like a football replay. Yes, the arrows and the thing. and American football, of course. Actual soccer football doesn't have replays. Because if you had a replay in soccer football, you go, Why is that millionaire pretending to be hurt? This isn't Twitter. Death to you, into the barriers. Death to you, death. Oh dear. Oh, hello. Ooh, there's a bit of sexual friss on for the uh, the barrier man. He's only got his eyes for barriers. Hey, 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 hey. A little bit of a uh, Russian dance there for us all <laughs> on the way. Actually, I'm gonna go in here like a fucking yeah. Kick that guy and kick that guy and kick that guy and kick that guy. That guy looked like he was going straight in the barrier. Ooh, but I'm uh, going through. Oh, <laughs> I just love the. I really enjoy. They're just cycling around and just seeing massive amounts of corpses. It's like watching real cycling. If anyone does that, I don't fucking know. I can say anything. Oh, God! Oh, what a jump! But no, seriously, nobody has ever actually watched any form of cycling on the television. I mean, why would you want to watch a man with one less testicle ride a vehicle with two less wheels? All right. Oh, big! Oh, big, massive accident! We've all, we've all actually we've joined hands. We've joined hands in the memoriam of the accident that we've had. Look at how the red guy on the left there's lost his fucking leg. <laughs> I, feel, I feel like this accident is already the monument to this accident. <laughs> just realised there's like a character selector screen so you can change the colours of the character. So I could actually make my guy nude. Yes, marvellous. My bike will also be nude. Actually, my bike is made of human skin. That's weird. Right, now I've got a nude cyclist who apparently has a... Uh, Sure, he's got, he's got, he's a new cyclist, but he's worn a belt recently, and you can still see it there. I, I just censor his ass crack. Oh, where is it? There, come back. There we go. Oh, oh, swerved out of the middle of nowhere, you bastard. Oh, hello. Oh, somebody threw a bit of a bicycle at me. That was me. <laughs> where are they coming from? And death to you. Oh, I kicked him, but nothing happened. He's, he's got very strong thighs now, man. He could be a rugby player. Just realise that doing that is very dangerous when you're nude on a bicycle. Never do that. So you're, you've learned something. Oh, actually, he's gone wonky. One of his legs hangs lower than the other or something. Ah! We're good. We're doubly good. Look at this guy with his helmet. Ah! <laughs> is what that guy was saying about me. Oh, I went to kick him in mid air and I've accidentally... Oh, I've gone for another barrier. I've had a bit of a touch of myself. 
Not, well, maybe he, I'm not. Barrier man, what he does in his own time, behind his own closed locked door. Without his wife, now she's left him, is his own personal whatever the fuck. Whoa, oh, the bike tire. Oh, in midair. Oh, God, I don't know what's happening down there. No, oh, no, I've dug a big hole for myself. I'm the Wall Street Journal. All right, it's a big group of them up here, and they're all blue. They're on the same team. Oh, he was paid to take me out, he was. He was paid to take me out. Why are you seductively leaning on a barrier? <laughs> it's like, yeah, this is my barrier. No, I don't know what's up with the barriers either, but it's just, it's in my head now, and it's its there for the foreseeable future, I'm afraid. I'm sorry. Oh, big accident! No! Oh, ow, oh. Okay, I'm just gonna... <laughs> Just gonna hang on, let's just cover that up. There we go. Oh, oh, somebody's gone through the drinks table. Oh, tight squeeze through there. Oh, oh, yeah, nailed it. Right through there. Double jumping kick. No, it didn't work. <laughs> Big jump, kick him in the air. D didn't need to. He didn't bother to jump. That was as much as his life was worth to him. That guy can piss off. Nice jump. Very straight and easy, this. Finish! I made it! I made it! I actually made it! Well, there you go. That was, uh... <laughs> Whatever that was called. I don't even remember anymore. Hang on, it's just a PG-13 it up. There you go, yeah, that was whatever that game was called. I, I can't remember what it was called, but ladies and gentlemen, it spoke to me. Spoke. Sp like the wheel. Please stay subscribed. The Nerd Cube! The Nerd Cube! Ah. The Nerd Who? Not you.